if someone comes up to ask for a photo, it's basically like somebody coming up and being like, can I lick your face? <laughs> a full stranger. <laughs> I love limes. <laughs> I love them. They're great. I love them so much and I like to present them like this in my house. I actually didn't even know that they were in there. I was giving the tour and went into the kitchen and they it was set dressing. I'm actually, I'm allergic to limes. Oh my, stop it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm mildly allergic. Coda Johnson lied to us about loving limes. I wanted you to see this table and chairs over here because this was made out of the wood from Winston Churchill's yacht. I'm not lying. And I think that's the coolest thing ever. And Has your dad seen the movie? Mm-mm. Good. You don't want your dad seeing that movie. No. Has your mom seen it? No. Yeah. Has your grandmother seen it? Yes. <laughs> Dakota Johnson has some serious <laughs> nose happening. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Zeppelin, oh sh don't, what are you gonna do? Go get it. That one's probably lost forever. Baby, no, please don't drink tequila at work. <laughs> Can I tell you something quickly, just like as a, just like a, a intermission from the game? Yeah. I saw Macaulay Culkin recently and I'd never seen him in real life, but I saw him because he was walking in the Gucci show. Was he really? And I, I was shocked. <laughs> Dude, you made that word three syllables. <laughs> shocked. <laughs> what the TV show that Dakota yeah, Johnson yeah, was yeah, in? Yeah. <laughs> Is that nervous left? Share <laughs> bushes. <laughs> we share bushes, yes. We have <laughs> mutual bushes. <laughs> My first movie was Crazy in Alabama. Good experience? My stepdad directed it and my mom played my mom, so it was just like home. <laughs> <laughs> Two of our mutual neighbors came up and said, hey, it's like a neighbor, it's like a block reunion. Yeah. And I was like, hey, how you doing? And you immediately <laughs> said, did you guys tow my grandfather's truck? <laughs> I don't know what happened. I turned into Medusa. I like <laughs> flung around and was like, ah. Yeah, you just like hoist up and slap on. <laughs> Do you yeah. use it for hauling? Are you someone who yeah. does their own hauling? Yeah, I haul so many stuff. I will say, yeah, because there's, I always see like stars are just like us and it's like Dakota's haul. hauling again. <laughs> Today I'm going to demonstrate how many things I can fit inside my gap tooth. Let's see how much money I can fit in my mouth. Dad, are you watching this? What a great skill. That's $1,100. I think you can go far with that. How was the party? I wasn't invited. Actually, no, that's not the truth, Ellen. You were invited. Last year, no, last time I was on the show, last year, you gave me a bunch of about not inviting you, but I didn't even know you wanted to be invited. Well, who doesn't want to be invited to a party? Well, I didn't even know you liked me. <laughs> of course I like you. You knew I liked you. You've yeah. been on the show many times, and, and don't I show like? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I did invite you, and you didn't come, so. This time you invited me? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. How do you know? I don't think so. Ask everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Ask Jonathan, your producer. Who okay. said you were? I yeah, was invited. Right Why didn't I go? I don't know. And then, but Tig Notaro performed at your party? She did. She did a set? She did. It was a surprise. What did she do? A bunch of funny stuff. She's hilarious. <laughs> She's my favorite comedian. <laughs> <laughs> Leslie just broke my dress. <laughs> okay, so, well. It's not like nobody here hasn't already seen my boobs. <laughs> um. Do you and Anastasia Steele have anything in common? No. Yes. Well, which is it? <laughs>
Fifty Shades of. <laughs> yeah, your grandfather left you uh, this, this truck. truck. It's a really cool old truck. It's a '95 F-150. Yeah. But it doesn't look super nice. No, it wasn't in front of their house. No, if it was anything, in front of my house. It was in front of both of our houses, <laughs> and I didn't have a problem was with it. Was it you? What? It, no. What? <laughs> what? No. <laughs> I didn't do it. No, it wasn't me. I would never do something like they that. They kept calling about it, and they kept saying, I really just don't want to look at it anymore. And I was like, well, then oh. look somewhere else. <laughs> oh, but I'm going to send them a cake. <laughs> <laughs> Of my truck. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that if my acting career fails, um, that I will either be a florist or I could be a um, professional race car driver. Really? Yeah. Those are two very different uh, paths. <laughs> Yeah. I feel like there are no uh, race car so drivers relaxing. currently who are like, it was either this or Flores. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to let people talk on the show? <laughs> I was like trying to take a video of these kids. <laughs> Oh my God! How, children, I know. How stalker you? I here. know, and I was like zooming, <laughs> zooming in. Excuse me while I go slip into a pair of old sweatpants. <laughs> no, but he just gave me three whole tomatoes. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. So he had uh, fresh produce on him? Well, they had some fresh produce somewhere in the <laughs> in the kitchen. <laughs> so he gave you tomatoes. So you had to make your own tomato juice. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. Well, and did it work? No, I just I cut them in half and I sort of just lined them up on top of my dog. <laughs> Your fans are upset because apparently everyone's broken hearted that the gap in your teeth is not there anymore. And fans are heartbroken. People are upset. No one knows what to say. What is going on? This is really important. Yeah. I'm sad about my gap tooth too, so I'd really appreciate some privacy in this time. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> First of all, don't demand. <laughs> Don't demand, don't clap for that. Don't, don't, don't demand or clap. You want to demand some privacy? Yeah. I think it looks beautiful. You don't well, need... I have to deal with a whole new world of problems. No. Getting food stuck in my tooth. That's your new thing? Yeah, because before it would just slide right through. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to Red Lobster. I'll get the Cheddar Bay biscuits. You can get the popcorn scramps. <laughs> you used to make reservations at a dinner, a dinner reservation at a restaurant under a <laughs> famous person's name. Do you know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You used to call up and say, you have a ta table for George Clooney. <laughs> yeah. Why? Because I wanted to go to the good restaurants in a, in, when I was growing up. When Do you I was know in high George school. Clooney? No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs>